All right, so let's start with the big story that we are tracking on Vyond at this hour. Russia has intensified its attacks on Ukraine as Moscow is continuing to push with its plan to invade further. The Russian forces are now attacking the critical power facilities of Ukraine. Now, Russia has carried out its latest assault on the already damaged power infrastructure. And according to the Ukrainian power grid operator, Russian missiles and drone attacks have targeted thermal and also hydro power plants in central and western Ukraine. Now, according to the Ukrainian energy minister, power facilities in the regions of Dnipropetrovsk, Poltava and Cherkasy were attacked by Russia. The largest private power firm, DTEC, has also said that three of its thermal power plants had come under Russian attacks. According to the Ukrainian military, its air force has managed to destroy as many as about 58 Russia-launched attack drones overnight from a total of 60, along with 26 of the 39 missiles. While last week Russia had attacked another critical infrastructure of Ukraine, the Russian missiles had pounded Ukraine's largest dam, the Denepron's in southern Zaporizhia region. The massive overnight attack was carried out by the Russians by the use of missiles and drones. The spree of Russian airstrikes have again made Ukraine pretty vulnerable. Kiev is asking its allies from the west to supply them with more air defense systems to secure their critical infrastructure and to protect the population. And the plea has come as Russia has intensified the attack on its neighbor on, in the backdrop of the terror attack in Moscow, where five armed individuals had stormed the Crocus City Hall concert venue killing at least about 140 people. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.